today I have no knife on my belt. I just have my pot and water and a tiny axe. I'm gonna try to light a fire with a flint and steel. It's okay now, but it's been raining all day, so everything is wet. But uh, I'm gonna try to make a fire. So as you can see, my shelter is gone. It was all rotten and broken. Still standing, I mean, but uh, the inside was not so good, so I took it down, kept all the good uh, pieces of wood, and now I'm gonna build another one. I have two beds here with a fire, and uh, yeah, the wood is here, so see it's uh, lot of wood. So if you guys got any ideas of what kind of a shelter I could make, I was thinking maybe a bigger lean-to instead of the A-frame uh, with a floor. But uh, yeah, if you guys got any, any ideas of what I could do about that. I got some wood here. I was thinking of a log cabin, but uh, I definitely don't have enough wood. So gonna, and I don't want to chop much live trees. So yeah, if you guys have an idea. For now, this is my camp. So got a tarp here that's still wet from last night, and two beds and my fire pits. Okay, so this is my cook set. So it's a mini barley party, and inside I have a cup and an algin bottle. And as far as tools, we are gonna use this small hatchet. From Grant's Forge Brooks. It's beautiful. Beautiful small hatchet. It's not that big. And we are gonna use my flint and steel kit. So here's a close up of the Kranz Vosbrooks. It's really small. But it feels good in the end. It's really, really nice. Here's a close up of the blade. Beautiful. So, so that's uh, my flint and steel kit. I'm gonna put a, a snap here, but for now, <laughs> it's all school. I just got a leather lace that I've made. Hey, here's some tea. Cool. It's not gonna be just hot water then. Well, if I can light my fire. And yeah, inside I have some flint, some amadou that I've processed. Just cut it in small slices, you boil it with the ashes in the water and then you smash it and let it dry and it 
Texas Park really nice and my friend striker my Viking friend striker it's uh, really nice that's what I gathered before I arrived here damp it's not not wet but it's damp still so we're gonna try to make a a bird, bird's nest with that Yeah, it looks okay. So this is my Maxpedition uh, Mini Rally Putty. It's really nice because it falls really small on the belt or on the rucksack. You have Molly here and you have a small belt loop here. So inside I put my titanium cup. It's uh, from Tox. It's, I've went backpacking with it. Uh, I ate it titanium it's a uh, 750 milliliters and uh, I cooked with it uh, for a long time when I was uh, in uh, Sweden backpacking it's really really light it comes with a lid so here I have my Nalgene bottle that fits it and it comes with a lid really nice lid and titanium too can have small end over here. Really nice. Obviously, you can use this uh, to put a water bottle, but uh, it's not really high, so you don't have much room. But uh, yeah, it works, and you can fold it this way. So it doesn't take some mushroom. And you can put some when you go out and gather some uh, tinders or uh, fruits, some food, some wild edibles. Uh, it's a really nice pouch. It's uh, really strong, I mean, <laughs> really, really strong material. And it's got a drain hole here. Okay, so I'm gonna make some fire now.
Okay guys, so now I'm gonna finish to drink my tea and uh, then I'm gonna head back home. Very nice. I love axes.